I know you're gonna dig this. I don't understand what's going on. Hey guys, welcome to today's This Is What Happened, but you missed because you weren't here. I don't know if mom started this or not yet, so if she did, double start. Um, but anyway, I'm just working on the spoiler. Homie, where are you going? Homie was chilling on my lap, but I guess my talking annoyed him. <laughs> Yeah, I like when he hangs out with me, but at the same time, he does this thing where he, like, digs his claws into you, like, every few seconds, and it's very painful. <laughs> yeah, but anyway, um, just working, got some lung lung going right now, good stuff. It's just, like, another dreary day. I don't know, I feel like we've had so many dreary days in a row and, like, rainy, which, I mean, we need the rain, so that's fine, but, like, can't we have a sun shower or something? <laughs> I'm just really sick of the cloudiness. It's just making me, like, bummed out. Um, but I think it's supposed to warm up this weekend, which is good. <sighs> Uh, I'm gonna get back to work. Oh yeah, so <laughs> all morning mom has been trying to get Lucy to like friggin pee in this Tupperware container because we have to take it to the vet to get tested but I don't know if Lucy is just being pee shy or she doesn't want to go out because of the rain because usually when it's raining she's like oh no I don't want to get wet so she doesn't go down the stairs um but I don't know. It hasn't been raining all day, but it has been kind of like damp and gross out. So I don't know if she's pee shy or it's the weather, but we're really, we're trying to get that pee pee into Tupperware. <laughs> ah! All right, I'm out and about. I was having a terrible day. I'm not gonna lie. This whole pee situation is really, really stressful. So I've been trying all morning. I've been trying all afternoon finally I got back from picking up Sean and I said if she doesn't go now I'm just gonna like call it quits for today and try again tomorrow so I went out with her with my Tupperware like a fool <laughs> stuck it under her got the sample she was like huh what's going on I was like eh don't worry so then um got my sample put it in the bag i got it in, i have it in a little like um you know prescription bottle that's made for that it's really made for poo poo but i put the feces i put the peepees in there so um and then i put it in a plastic bag you know like a sandwich <laughs> keep it fresh because i don't want anybody to have touched the outside of the bottle even though i was extremely careful to not get any on the outside of the bottle it's all on the inside so now i have i'm going to the vet which is not exactly next door i mean it's pretty far everything up here away from the city is a trip when we first moved up here 20 six years ago 26 almost 26 years ago it was like nothing around we didn't even have a supermarket so the vet that we chose I was like I need a vet that's flexible because I had um, well when we got um, Peewee the first dog that we ever had as a, a, you know married family situation um, they were the only vet that was open on Sundays. So I thought, wow, that's really good because um, I can't handle to bring a dog and three kids to the vet. So I'm going to have to wait for Mark to be home. And he worked Monday through Friday and like they just had fantastic hours. So we decided to go to them. But unfortunately, they're like very far away from the house. But back then it was like nothing because they were the only ones around. So now I have to walk into the vet <laughs> with my jenksy bag and be like, um, here, there's no easy way to be like, here's some urine. You just got to go right for it and be like, okay, I got my sample. <laughs> just like when you go to a regular doctor and they're like, all right, you go in the bathroom over there and uh, yeah, pee in the cup. And then you're always like, well, what do I do with the cup? Now, within the last few years, they didn't used to do this before, they have a little window in the bathroom. You put it in the 
little window and you shut the door and somebody on the other side takes it like magic. It's just like a Las Vegas magic show where they put that girl in the box and then she's not there and then she comes back. They do the little Exactly. All right, baby. May the fourth be with you. Remember when I said that in the spoiler and I just said the regular one? <laughs> May the foot, whatever. Yeah, I gave yeah. up. You know what it's I got to Cinco say? Cinco de Cuatro. That's what today is. Yeah, but you know what I got to say? Star Wars, baby. It's Star Wars. Oh, we were really quiet <laughs> the there. Why do you have to kill your jewelry? Betty, don't even it? pretend like you're not like that. I wasn't going to say anything. I don't do that as much as I used to. Yeah. <laughs> I read that book by Andrew Carnegie about making people like you. People do not like to be corrected when it's not totally necessary. Thank you. I don't think they like to be corrected when it is totally necessary either. I'm just saying, like, well, obviously, if it was really bad, well, that's why like Kristen something like life threatening Joy. or whatever. Kristen's All right. It's taco night. Takis. <laughs> <laughs> Salty tacos. Yeah, sorry the uh, the oh, cheese is. Did you make that rice like that again? I did, but <laughs> that cheese is a little too salty. Oh, okay. I I went a little heavy handed. Sorry, kids. That's okay. Sorry, husband. That's perfect. You can make lashes. What? <laughs> uh, that was my idea. Thank you. What? So thanks for fixing my glasses. I fixed glasses. Kristen's glasses oh. with Daddy. It doesn't mean you can still wear them. It was those. it was so a two step process. Ooh, look at what you got there. You did it. No, you didn't. You got the screw in. I just tightened it. You screwed it. How many people does it take I to tighten. fix a pair of glasses? What? How many people does it take to fix a pair Apparently two nerds. <laughs> oh, honey. I forgot to take out the salad, so you can take out the salad. Okay, mom hair. It's not a fun braid like Kristen's got going on there. Bo boho braid. <laughs> I invented the boho braid. Yeah. yeah. Okay. All right. Let's see what let's see what Daddy thinks of this. Mm. Takis, takis. That's really annoying. <laughs> What? Really really it was supposed to be. Well, then I you meant got your to feedback. do that. Okay, well then you got what you wanted. Ooh, what a mood. Okay. Well, I hope everyone enjoys. We got tacos and Survivor and Big Brother and, <laughs> and Real Housewives of New York City. Oh my God! Too much goodness all at once. My head's getting. Oh my God! Slowed. We should watch a little bit of the next. People's couch because dad loves it too. All right, but we have to. I know. We have to start Survivor no later I know. than 8:15. Like Thank you, segment. Sean. We're only gonna watch one segment. All right, one segment. <laughs> I'm so addicted to the people's couch so right now. Oh my God. I have to say thank you, Louie, for. Uh, Joy's always talking about it too. Thank you, Joy. Thank Joy. you, Louie. Yes. Thanks for talking it up. Hello. Hello. It's dessert time. We gotta give a little. Call to call to prayer. Call to prayer for longtime viewer Tara's dad is having a very important test tomorrow. She so. said it's like four hours long. Is it really? Yeah, that's crazy. So if you guys could remember him in your prayers or your positive vibes mm -hmm. or whatever it is that you do to send. Mm -hmm. And also for our puppy. He's Puppy's having, having an important test, test tomorrow. tomorrow too. He's having um his lymph node aspirated to see. It's like a biopsy. Gotta see what's going on in there. Yeah. So we'd really appreciate it because we love our puppy so much. Mm -hmm. AKA Flash. Yeah. And of course, we sent in Lucy's pee pee today. <laughs> <laughs> Which that was very uh, in depthly <laughs> documented here. That was a lot. I'm sorry. <laughs> that like ate up the whole day. It Literally. was a lot. All right. Well, at least it's done. Mm -hmm. Hopefully, the results will be good. And guys, we appreciate you in the comments on yesterday's video. Mm -hmm. Remembering our puppies in the in the video, we really appreciate you thinking about them. It mean they mean the world to us. They do. And for you to um, tell us that you care about them, that means a lot to us. 
so we really appreciate that. But we're having dessert right now. Are you ha how much? Say blue, blue, when. Blue. Oh, okay. One more? <laughs> no. We're having just a little tasting bowl here. Mm hmm. Um, life cereal. It's giving me life. <laughs> That's Literally. the point. And a little bit of nuts. They should make that their Lightly new salted. campaign. It gives you life. Yeah. We're mm -hmm. giving you life. <laughs> no shirt. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Not sponsored. Embrace the younger audience. Yeah, exactly. Yes! <laughs> These are like Virginia Slims, but the seltzer version. <laughs> okay. Look how far you've come, baby. Yeah, look. <laughs> I don't want to drop <laughs> don't it. Don't drop it. Don't drop it. You've come a long way, baby. <laughs> to New York City to get you drunk <laughs> on seltzer. <laughs> yeah, that's what I'm talking about. You already brushed, sir. Sorry, bud. Oh. I love you. I love you. Do you love everybody in there? I do. You Thanks. do? Thanks for watching. Till next time, let's love. Edit. Oh,